Hey, welcome to another Swamp Fox Optics video. So we were digging in the deepest, darkest depths of our safe and found this interesting little uh, toy that we're gonna have some fun with today. It's a 300 blackout bolt gun. So we slapped a, a scope on there and the biggest can we could find, and we're gonna go play. We're gonna zero it, chrono it, and take it out to long range to see how far we can shoot it. The process of finding this, the Kentucky Long 2 12, um, the Ruger had a weird rail system on it, so this is the only mount we had. We wanted to do LPVOs, other optics, Raiders, but this kind of just made sense, especially on something short to mid-range. The 2 to 12 made sense. It's actually the only thing that fit. We're sitting at 50 yards, and we're going to try to zero this thing, see how it does. Firing. One inch low, one inch left. I'd say bring it up two inches. Your windage is good. That last one was right in the bottom. Yeah. Bullseye. Sweet. Inch low, inch right. Top bullseye. All right, so we started zeroing. We were hitting a little bit low. We kind of worked our way up. We're bouncing around. It's an interesting gun. Uh, but we got it. We got ourselves here in our bullseye after about 10 shots. So I think we're ready to roll. What do you think? We're good. Cool. Are you still calling HR? Yeah. All right. On you. Every time. Okay, so we're just going to confirm zero one last time, and then we are going to attempt to get. Uh, to get our, our velocity with this chrono here, but this thing is really, really quiet, and so it's not picking it up. You ready? Yep. All right, let's see what we got. This thing's crazy. Ten fifty one. Ten forty six. That is low and slow. That was a five shot group with an average of 1050.3. We're gonna be loving these things. Yeah, that's gonna be bad. <laughs> we just had a five shot group with our 300 blackout. We had an average of 1050.3 with a standard deviation of 10.9. Around 15 feet per second standard deviation is 
Good, so this 10.9 is awesome. Subsonic 300 blackout is, this stuff is showing up less than half of your typical 5.56 round. So this thing is pretty slow, quiet, moving forward. So we're gonna see what we can do with it at a longer range. But let's first check out what we got downrange. So this is our second group. We just moved and chose a different point of aim just so we didn't shoot on top of our old group. And yeah, five shot group right there. Looks like we're pretty well zeroed. I think we're ready to go on to the next one. I think we could hit it 600. Not a chance. No. Of course we can. <laughs> I think you can. I don't think I can. I think it's gonna be a lot of luck. Are we gonna make a cash game out of this? Do you want to bet on it? A little bit. First one to hit 600 with this thing, 20 bucks. 20 bucks? 20 bucks. Or they have to do RMAs for the next week. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm not gonna take that bet, 100 bucks. <laughs> RMAs are returns, and I do the returns. We only have one guy doing returns because we don't get returns. <laughs> uh, come on, let's go quit screwing around, Seth. Notice how my group is better than his. He's my boss. So we're here at the 600 yard range. We have a 400, 500, and 600 yard steel target. Um, we're gonna walk it out. We have the spotting scope set up. Help us see, track our hits. This is gonna be pretty tough. Yeah, it's gonna be interesting. These things are going at 1050 feet per second. So we're gonna be we're gonna be having to throw these things pretty high to get them on target. So we're about to find out how high. Ready? Yeah. All right. We got a spotting scope set up right here. We're gonna be recording. And we're gonna see what this thing does. So I'm gonna start out shooting at 400 yards and I'm going to, I'm gonna aim just a little bit high and we're gonna see how low it hits. You ready? Ready. All right. Okay. All right. I am firing. <laughs> like 20 feet low. That was, that was holding, uh, I, barely made that sucker. <laughs> I was holding six mils above it. Yeah, try like 14 mils above it. Yeah, all right. <laughs> I'm gonna run out of it. Firing. Walking, I think you. That was a little close. I think the ricochet hit, ricochet hit it though. What? I heard it. <laughs> I swear. <laughs> All right, firing. Still short. All right. I'm at the bottom of the tree. We're at about 16 mils now, 400 yards. He goes high. That was 14. That's like 100 feet short. All right. <laughs> this is getting interesting. This is already getting very interesting. I don't think this is gonna go too well. Let's see. All right, I am firing. Hi. That's good news. Yep. All right. That was high. That's very high. <laughs> These things go so slow. <laughs> Takes about five minutes for it to get down there. Is that a hit? No call. I'm at about six power here and running out of reticle. These things are going into outer space. All right, ready? Ready.
nothing. Oh, that was it. Wherever your hold was. <laughs> Is that finally a hit? No. You were, you're probably like a foot in front of the head of the mountain lion. No, not oh, really. Gonna hit that I'm one. enjoying oh, this. Oh. It's ridiculous, but it's a, a fun experiment. So. What'd you guys spend on this? 20 bucks. And John doing my job for the next week. No, I said screw that. 100 bucks. I'm not. I don't remember job. that. Like Subsonic. Yeah. Wait. It should be my turn now, John. Subsonic 300 blackout at 50 yards. <laughs> <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> All right, we, we almost got it. I figured out where I'm holding. Let's see if we can do this. Right in front. Did you see it? No idea. Nothing. Oh. That must have been left or right. Short. These are not accurate. They're all over the place. Oh, right over its back. <laughs> this is ridiculous. This is great for shooting a dinosaur at 400 yards. Off of the berm. I said I didn't hit it. Three mags. That was terrible. I think that was like six mags. Really. That was three. Shut up. All right. So I apparently could not hit it at 400 yards. It's uh, all over the place. But Seth, our marksman here, is about to win a bet. So show me what you got, Seth. Ready to do some returns, John? Yes, sir. <laughs> so I'm holding uh, at that magnification. What am I at now? You're at five. <laughs> so where you're at five, and I'm holding like at four, 12 to 14, right in the middle there somewhere. It seems to be all over the place. That's offset. I think you're just scared. Also, you uh, you can't have any time off for your hunting trip this year. Hmm conveniently get fired during hunting season. What's that? Works for me. <laughs> uh, your job's so easy, we can plug anybody in. Yeah. I'll give him a $100 bill right now if you hit it on the first round. Hey, that's Seth, if you hit it on the first round, I'm gonna give you a $100 bill right now. close same spot it's a it's a couple feet uh, to the left were you holding right for the wind or no no but they're all over the place that was a hit nice only <laughs> took three I think 300 blackouts a great long range. That was three. Let's take this to the next. Uh, <laughs> we'll take this to the next thousand yard. Every shot's a dollar. I want that. So I'm twelve dollars up right now. Yeah. Oh, so Doug's coming in hot. I held right at the 14. Keep recording. And I put the 14 on the book. 14 on the book. Yeah. All right, Jorge stepped in. Jorge. Hold it on the butt. Mm. Let's see what you got. I don't know how you guys hit anything with this. Can you leave it at five? Leave it at five. I just gotta figure out which one is friggin' 14. It's all in the hips. The very bottom one. All in the hips. Don't touch me. I'm not touching you yet. If I get a first round impact, I want that 100 bucks. Okay, I'll give you 100 bucks you get first see, round impact. See, this way you can't be the HR guy, John. Yeah, I'm definitely not human resource. <laughs> Here we go. How's 
just trigger. It's easy. Nice and light. Okay. So 14 on the butt. It's yeah. probably a two and a half no win right now. Oh, oh gosh dang it. Oh that was so a close. A little bit high. I think he was low. No, that was low. Right on the I saw the dust kick up right at his really, tail. It's extremely inconsistent out there. Hit, hit. Yeah. <laughs> I don't get anything yet, but <laughs> at least I got it in two. <laughs> Okay, so you just gotta let somebody else figure out the whole one. Yeah, you just 14. What we're gonna do now is have a small competition. Uh, what best? We're gonna take 10 shots at our 400 yard target. Have a rough idea of where we're trying to hold, and we're gonna see uh, see who can, who can hit it the most at 400, and the winner gets uh, to shoot three more rounds. Sounds good. We're running out of. There's air. also tornadoes going on down there, so yeah. it kind of adds to the. Alright, you're going first or Mike? You got it. Going first? Alright, let's see how this goes. Ready? Ready. Firing. Is yep. that your first five? Yeah. Three misses, two hits? Yeah. Hit. All right, I hit 50% of my shots. You ready? Four or five you five. hit? I hit two on the first one, three on the second okay. one. All right, Seth, let's see what you got. Where were you holding? Tell you what, I got something for you. If you beat me, I'm gonna give you a free small fox t-shirt. Oh, and sick. And I'll have the artist who designed it sign it for you. Sick. Yeah. Can't wait. I don't think I have any of those. What's your confidence level right now? About an eight. So you're gonna go eight, uh, for 10. eight for ten. We'll see. The first one, I have no idea. Wow. Eight for ten. <laughs> we'll see. Yeah, I guess you're gonna get that T-shirt, aren't you? Maybe. That was it. All right, Seth, you hit seven, I hit five. You win by a little bit. I was only one off. I would have passed, seven, he's passing, you failed. I bet this would be easier to do with a 45 pistol. It probably would be. <laughs> All right, so we had our little competition. We had some fun. Uh, Seth beat me. I seem to get beat a lot. That's, I guess I let him win. <laughs> But He's uh, my boss. So 300, bl 300 blackout, subsonic through a little bolt gun that we found in the safe. Big suppressor on the front of it. Um, you pretty much have to aim to the sky to get it to land at 400 yards. We, we figured out our hold when the wind slowed down. And uh, let's never do this again. This is a terrible waste of pretty nice ammo. But well, this Ruger American is awesome. It's, this would be a cool coyote gun to throw on the back of the truck. Yeah, it's, awesome. it's fun. I, I can't say I didn't have fun doing this. Yeah. I kind of want one now. I don't know why. Because like, know what your pro is nice. That's why. Yeah, I feel like we should do this again with my, my little AR. Mm -hmm. That'd be fun. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching. We had a great time using the Kentucky Long 2 to 12. If you're interested in getting yourself a Kentucky Long or an optic for any other gun you have in your safe, check out smallboxoptics.com. Thanks for watching, and we will see you in the next video.